Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for a week commencing the 25th of March 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, create your future and transform your present. Raise your consciousness, remember why you are here, come out of that spiritual closet and take the steps on your spiritual journey to fulfill your purpose in this lifetime. Now, this week we're going to be using the Goddess Dream Oracle Cards by Wendy Andrew. But before we get into this week's reading, I'd like to say thank you so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be of service to you and for you to trust me enough to use my services. So thank you. And thank you to those who have subscribed to my YouTube channel, who follow me on Facebook or Instagram, like, share, comment on my posts. It really does mean a lot to me. Um, that you take the time to do that. And of course, it helps me get my message out there. So you're helping spread around the, you know, the word of unconditional love. So thank you so, so much for that. And don't forget, you know, check out all the workshops that I run, all the services I offer, you know, Angelic Reiki, Future Life Progression, Past Life Regression, card readings, guided meditations, my afternoon tea with the angel, my evening meditations, Future Life Progression Workshop, Angelic Reiki Workshop. You know, there are so many things I do during the year, um, you know, and every month. So please do check them check them out because it would be lovely to see you um, there or on, in person or online or connect with you um, on a one-to-one -one basis. So as always, I'll give the cards a quick cleanse and a bless. Oh, and before we do this, Happy birthday to my sister Lee, whose birthday is on Wednesday the 27th. Happy birthday. So what does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good for week commencing the 25th of March 2024? What does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good for week commencing the 25th of March 2024? Okay, so let's see what cards are going to come out for you. They're making me work for them this week, which is always fun when that happens. <clears throat> okay, ooh, cards going everywhere. So let's see what the cards have got for you. Okay, so we have got strength. Know your strength. We have got new beginnings. Take a fresh look at life. Isn't that perfect for the time of year it is? And dreaming, be aware of your dreams. Okay. So what the cards are saying to me this week is that you have the strength um, within you. You are the power behind what you do in your lifetime. You have the ability to speak your truth, to be who you truly are. So what the cards are saying this week is don't allow anyone else or anything to stop you from, you know, taking those steps for being strong, for being true to you, for, for that roar that you've got, you know know that you have the strength, you can do and achieve anything you want that's for your highest good and the highest good of everyone around you. So don't let anything or anyone damper that down this week. You know, there are new beginnings um, coming in. You, you know, take a fresh look at life. You know, what new possibilities, what opportunities are out there? But also you can take a look at your own life. Take a look at your own life through 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 the eyes of someone else. I mean, when you look at um, other people's lives, you go, oh, well, I like what they're doing there. Oh, they shouldn't be doing that. Or maybe they should have done that. Do that on your own life. You know, there are various ways. There are guided meditations. You can just go in, breathe, center yourself. Okay, let's look at my life from a higher perspective. Let me look down. What's going on? What is good? What isn't good? You can write it down. You know, everything that's perfect in your life and the things that aren't perfect. And you'll probably notice that all the blessings, gratitude, perfection will far outweigh the um, other side of the uh, other side of the lift and lift, lift, lift and concentrate on those, those positive things in your life. What can you do to enhance them? What can you do to improve them? What changes can, can you make? Um, you know, I did a post, um, I was out the other day and I had this musing come in, you know, it was windy, the winds of change, you know, they're coming in at the moment, you know, you can pivot your life, you can move, you, move, you know, you can move your life, change it, 
what do you want to what do you want to change it to you have the power the strength to do that nobody else can do that for you you have the power what changes do you want to make what do you want to bring into your life you know look at what's happening in nature you know with um uh, birds and flowers and baby animals all, all, you know, coming out rebirth. You know, this is the ideal time of the year to do that. But also pay attention to your dreams this week. You know, dreams can tell us so much about what's going on in our life. So before you go to sleep, set the intention, you know, in my dreams tonight, can you give me the answer to this? How do I move forward? What can I do about this? And when you wake up, you know, take a note of the first things that come in your head. Take a note of your dreams. And if you find that you don't remember your dreams, think about daydreaming. You know, children do it all the time and they have such, you know, they have the passion, the strength to do what they want to do. So take the time during the day. You know, even if you're sitting on the toilet, you know, just look out of the window. Um, well, maybe not if you're in the bathroom, but you know what I mean. You know, just look out of the window, take the time. Just admire what's going on, even if it's a, a busy traffic street, you know, everything going on and allow yourself to daydream. What do you want in your life? Where do you want to be? You know, what if I was a pilot flying a plane? What if I had that perfect relationship? And just allow yourself to daydream, you know, see it, feel it, imagine it. Imagination can always become reality. So take this time to we the time this week to daydream to try and remember your dreams. Yeah, and that's that's really what the you know the cards are saying for me this week. You know, know that you have the strength. You are your power. I mean, isn't that a beautiful card? You know, speak your truth for the highest good of yourself and all others. New beginnings. Take a fresh look at life. You know, you've got the hairs, you've got the egg, you've got the flowers. This is spring. What are you going to spring forward and bring in? What changes are you going to make? And dreaming, be aware of your dreams. Take note of what dreams you have. Daydream. What do you daydream about? They can be so, they can give you answers to your future, to your now, to your present. And as always, this is my interpretation of the cards. You may get a completely different interpretation and that is just absolutely fine. I draw these cards for what you need to know for your highest good. So if there's one particular card that stood out for you or you got your own interpretation, then go with that. You know, and do let me know in the comments or message me privately. I always reply to anyone who messages me publicly with the comments or who messages me privately um, because I love hearing your your views, your versions, and whether you actually agree with me or not. Um, so yeah, so do, that, um, so do let me know about that. And as I said, do check out what else I have to offer. You know, I love being of service and helping you out. And of course, don't forget to check out my show, Angels and Destiny, which if you're watching this on Sunday the 25th, is taking place on Monday. So if you're watching this Sunday 24th, then on Monday the 25th, 8 p.m. UK time, I've got the beautiful Laurie Morse coming back on my show. We had a brilliant conversation last time. Looking forward to seeing her again. And if you're watching later in the week, then watch the replay. You can even join in around with the replays because we do circle back and look at any comments, hellos um, that, are, that have come in. And do continue to share, subscribe, like, comment, um, everything I do. And of course, happy birthday to my sister for Wednesday. And have a wonderful week. Enjoy the um, Easter break if you get any time off and enjoy being with family and friends. Take care. Bye.